At least the rescue's going well. can make it. You cannot. Ow, ow, ow! Easy! To me! Follow! We, uh, got company back here. Oh, no. Okay, okay. Uh, we're almost there, right? Archers ahead! Oh, seriously? Not that! Oh. Ah! 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 Ah!
Nice job, by the way. Hey, I'm a train. You okay? Hi. Right. No. Just hold on. You gotta be close, right? On your right! Keep going! We're almost at the river! Oh, I'm about to hurl. Where's the boat? Let's throw it in the river. Hurry now. That won't hold them for long. Oh, of course. Excuse me, Freya. Freya's boat. They will regroup. We should go. seeing your faces. <laughs> Relax. It's flying. We're flying. I knew we would do that. I think that's the end of Birger. You think he survived that? 
He's down there picking the dirt out of his nails with the beast's feathers. You'll see. He... Uh, <laughs> he has to be. We're almost there, Ingvi. Just hold on a bit longer. I don't suppose I have much of a choice at the moment. Cloth and boiling water. Red root and lamb's press. I know, I know. You think I never staunched a bleeder before? Oh, now don't you go worrying, boss. I didn't go through any of your stuff while you was off being tortured. Ah, damn it, Linda. Easy. Heck you says it made for. I ain't the one who stuck you like a damn pig. No offense. Freya, mind giving her a hand? We're just taking over entirely? Hold still. She'll just get you stable so I can take you to Sindri's house. The rest of my herbs are there. We'll protect the realm in your absence. The four of us. Vadaheim's in good hands. Party at Sindri's house, huh? Whoever that is. Your boat. Nope. Your boat. Go on. Take it. Sail the skies, sun yourself on its bow. You look like you could use it. <laughs> Make a Vanir god proud. He gave you his boat? Nice. He left me no choice. Because it was necessary, not because it was written. Prophecy holds that Galahorn is the Herald of Ragnarok. Whatever it does. I read about it in Odin's library. Find that orb, yeah? Hold it, Treus. We will discuss in private. Oh, definitely need that. Time I had something to do. Let's make something then. Feels like there was something else. Let's do it. Hitting the road or chewing the fat? What 
does that mean? Oh. Helka smells something. Could be important. Maybe we should follow her. Tracks. Helka's. So, what do you want to do now? We don't have to go straight home, do we? <laughs> oh, guess what? While Odin was giving me a tour, his ravens took us to Svartalfond. And I saw ah, Dylan again. You can always try finding Helka some other time. I wanted to tell you. I read something in Odin's library about what Galahorn is supposed to do. Blown by a god, it sounds through all the realms and harmonizes the space between them. Well, it's somewhere like Tyr's Temple, and it would be like opening up all the realm travel towers at once. It's quite a vulnerability. Wonder why he didn't just destroy it. Some artifacts defy destruction. Well, we should make Freya aware of this. Speak. The tree has become rather overgrown. And? And if it grows too wildly, the branches risk getting too heavy and falling, which is not ideal considering they hold all the rounds. I am no gardener. What an absolute shock. No, I do not require any horticultural skills from you, but I would ask that you keep an eye open for the stags of the four seasons. They normally graze upon the tree and keep it tight. Unfortunately, Bitter decided it would be funny to trick Arrogant into releasing them. If you happen to find the stags during your travels, I would greatly appreciate assistance in bringing them home. I would have one of my spectral squirrels do it, but they, well, keep eating the feed I give them. Consequence of it being the most delicious food in all the Nine Realms, I suppose. Speaking of, here, take some feed. Once you've found a stag, the feed should calm them down. Then, one of my spectrals will guide them back here. And, uh, don't eat the feed, please. I will not. Bitterness asked me if I was too chicken to release them. But I am, in fact, not chicken-like whatsoever. So as you can see, I have no choice. We now, are leaving. Any luck finding those lean worms? <laughs> Hey, tell her she's the best. Oh! Enough. Look at that. <laughs> you really did it. How, in all the nine realms, did you manage to kill Heimdall? I knew our spear would do the trick. Well, happy Ragnarok, everybody! Let's drink. Is it true? I'm Dahl's dead. I can't believe it. There's no stopping it now. Odin swore peace only so long as you spilled no more Aesir blood. I refuse that deal. Yet he honored it. But now... But what? You and I know better than anyone that Odin's promises never last. We have the advantage now. It's time to bring him down. No. None of you understand what's coming. Odin's vengeance will be his only concern. Not his only concern. The mask. Whatever knowledge it unlocks, that's what Odin wants more than anything. If I go back to Asgard, go I can... Go back. Go. Back. Look. If I can finish what I started there, 
awaken the mask, get answers. Maybe that's our way out of this. But I gotta go soon. Before they figure out what's happened. Joyce, you are home. Do not ask me to put you at risk again. He's at risk where he stands, Kratos. We all are. Anything we do or don't do is dangerous right now. But Odin needs me. He trusts me. I'll be safe there. From a tactical perspective, am I wrong? I don't much like it, but it is our best play. Dividing Odin's focus would buy us time. And give us a pair of eyes in the enemy's inner sanctum. But if there is truly a source of infinite knowledge, you can't let Odin have it. Aye. And once he has what he needs from you... Then I lose my leverage. I get it. I'll be smart. Father. I can do this. Remember our promise. You too. I hope you know what you're doing. I do too, Sam. Well, I still want to hear how you did it. You mean how we did it? Ah, uh, you have me. And therein lies a tip. Trace, listen. I can't let you go back without this. A hammer? Your key, please. You ever need a way out of a bad situation? Throw this down hard and say, Wergi. One use only. Wergi. Thanks, Sindri. Hope I don't need it. Me too. All right, Odin said Hugin would be waiting in the cabin. Mimir, anything else I should know about Odin? Maybe a weakness or something? Like if I flip up his eye patch, he'll disintegrate. Ay, lad, will not be. Yeah, no. Sorry, Mimir, I can't do your accent. I'm on my own for this one. Oh, were you having a moment? It sort of looked like you were having a moment. I can go. No. Sorry. This is Fenrir. Mm. It's okay, Fen. She's, uh... <laughs> <laughs> so, I was right about your knife. Huh? I'm glad you found a place for his soul. <laughs> me too. Hey, uh, how'd you find me here? Loki? This is my marble. And where are you heading off to? Back to Asgard. Hey, 
I'm actually using him. Uh huh. Angerboda, look. Once I see this through, I'm gonna know everything. How to save my father, how to stop Ragnarok, and maybe, hopefully, how to bring our people back. Loki, those are all very noble intentions. But he's Odin. You have faith in me, right? Of course I do. I just hope the story you're writing for yourself is the one that you truly want. Would you... Would you take care of Fen while I'm away? I'll take good care of him. Good night, boy. <laughs> Be careful, Loki. Okay. Odin complete the mask, but also make sure he doesn't get any answers from it. Easy, right? It's probably in a study. themselves doesn't mean they're guilty. I mean, what kind of messed up logic is... Heimdall's dead. Suddenly hey, this uh... Sorry for interrupting. <laughs> You're not interrupting anything. Forsetti's investigating, so the truth will come out soon enough. I hope it does. You'd better go. <laughs> <laughs> 